Hello there ladies and gentlemen. So today I'll be showing you how to go back to Android 9 if you're already on Android 10. Now I have a video on this already but this is more like if you're kind of fucked and you want to go back to Android 10 basically. But Asus uh, released a handy yoke here. So what you want to do is download this. You actually don't need your computer for this, so you can just download it straight onto your phone. And then you actually want to rename this file. So thanks to Johnny Breed for pointing this out. You need to rename it to exactly this. I'll leave this in the uh, description or comments or somewhere. So I thought it was straightforward, you download the file and then off you go, but no, you actually need to rename it and Asus doesn't tell you this, which is kind of annoying, but whatever. So then the easiest way to rename it is if you connect your phone to your computer, you should, and then click on it, you should see internal storage, go into that, and then copy the file inside here. And then you would want to rename it to this. Then once that's done, if we go back to the phone here, you can unplug it. And you would want to restart it as well. And after each restart, there should be a notification. All right, so once the phone is restarted, you can type in your password and then you can just wait for the update file to, yeah, so there we go. You'll get an update notification. Now, if you are not rooted, you can tap this file straight away and, um, proceed to install. If you are rooted, you will need to basically unroute yourself. So open up Magisk Manager and then type uninstall and restore images. Then once that's done, don't reboot your phone or anything like that. And then just tap the update file and then press OK. I'm not going to do that, but Basically, after you press OK, there'll be like progress bar here. And then once it finishes, your phone will restart and you'll be on Android 9, basically. Now, I'm not going to do that because Android 10 is fine for me. So, yeah, once again, if you are still not getting the notification, go to File Manager, click on Internal Storage and make sure the file is like basically inside the internal storage. So it should be like, you should see your downloads folder and you should see your uh, update file here in the same place as well. So that's that. So I wanted to make this quick video cause apparently it's not super straightforward to upgrade or downgrade, I mean. So yeah, uh, thanks for watching and bye bye.